everybody, welcome back to another episode of Falcon Plays, uh, Neil Scavenger. Uh, the modded build. I almost called it RimWorld, that's the reason why it sounds a little bit awkward, because it was just like, on the tip of my tongue, and I was like, nope, nope, really back in, this is Neil Scavenger. We're doing a modded run over here, guys, so I think it's a makeshift mod if I'm correct. If I'm still incorrect about it again, the proper mod is in the description, so I'm still part of the same day of recording, so that's the reason why I don't know it just yet. Either way, off camera, I went and did a little bit of, um, building for us, just so you guys didn't have to, like, deal with the monotony of that. I had to leave my chopping knife and the Wolverine Whiskey Black Bottle aside because I wanted to take some small parts. The medium string, um, because we do need some of this stuff for the, um... You know, future stuff that I kinda wanna build. But I already did build a bow, so we got the Greenwood Bow, obviously, that's the basic one to build. We're looking for either the compound bow or maybe even the um, ATN bow at some point or another. But, you know, little some small steps first. I didn't have enough to actually make the um, arrows. I think I'm missing um, paper. Paper is the only thing I was missing right now. So, unfortunately, I can't make any arrows. So, instead, I decided to make the sling because um, it'll prove a little bit useful meanwhile. And I've heard the sling is actually kind of decent. I never used it before, so I figured, hey, might as well give it a try. And everything else is pretty much as you see it. So let's continue going onward here. Um, we're pretty much done with our turns though, so we do have to end our turn here. And we will. We're tired. As night falls, you notice there is a bright glow coming from the east, easy, easily visible through the tree tops. There's no guarantee, but it could be a sign of civilization, maybe even. This basically tells us about DMC. So DMC is still around too, right? Yeah, okay. But that's okay because we don't care about DMC right now. We only care about um, going to the refugee camp to see what this is all about. So, it is going to be nighttime, so we're going to be, our movement is going to be kind of slowed now, which is unfortunate, but you know, it's kind of the lay of the lands here. What I would love to do is get some rest, though. However, we have, we do have insomnia, meaning it's going to take us a little bit of time, actually, or a bit of an effort to fall asleep. And I just ran into some dude over here with a sharpened spear. That could be actually really terrifying. Um, okay. I could do a suitcase slam. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. Slung pebble, slung stone. Alrighty, um, so, let's see, this guy, I really don't want to fight you, my friend, um, I'm, I'm apologizing that you were here first, I just wanted to also get some sleep. Like, if you would let me, like, you know, hunker down here with you, I, I'll stay on one side of the house, you could stay in the other one, we could just, like, both relax, so, how about, um, how about a ceasefire? Nope, nope, he absolutely wants something to do with that, he wants to fight. Uh, he charges at me, but he tripped, because he's a fool, so he's temporarily distracted, okay. Um, I'm not gonna wait, if that's what you're asking me to do. So, I have no point. I have nothing to do here, so I have to, unfortunately, confirm this. He is gonna have to get up. He's gonna fuck my shit up because it's sharp. he has a sharpened spear. There's absolutely nothing I could do here. I'm gonna try to sling this and see what happens. Oh, he's a bad mother. No wonder he wants to fight. Alrighty, so I'm gonna toss this and see what happens. Um, you know, <laughs> we only have one shot and here it goes. Oh, um, bad mother's falling to the ground. This guy's a, a fool, apparently. A uh, player is falling to the ground. Oh, no, 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 I didn't sling him at all. I mean, basically, he tackled my ass down. Okay, that's not really good whatsoever. This guy is gonna destroy us. He's gonna fucking destroy my life. I don't know what to do. Range attack? Uh, range attack on the floor? I have to, like, land this hit? Okay. Uh, players expose these... Oh, cool. Um, I missed. That's swell. So now I'm completely fucked. Now I just need to, um, get up and... Get the fuck out of here before this man stabs me with that spear of his. So we're gonna basically do a uh, desperate retreat here. I was able to get away, thankfully. Uh, oh, oh lord, that was fucking quite terrifying. You know, it's a different, it's a, what the hell is this doing up here? River, do you guys see this? River, get out of there, you don't belong up here. So, is that, am I on a river right now? Oh, I am. Okay, nice, I'm actually a little bit thirsty so I can get some water here. Um, that's part of the, the the reason I'm scared of being ranged, because, you know, you get put in some tough situations here. Of course, I do have my... I could have made myself a broad spear meanwhile, but, um, you know, I'm already kind of hurting for space here, so I didn't do that. Alright, um... We need to keep running, unfortunately, though. I'm not sure where to run towards. I'm gonna just go up towards this fucking town, though. Maybe he'll leave me alone. <laughs> Scavenge this area. No open field. Uh, I'm tired. I just need to get some rest. That's all I really wanted to do, and this guy was being a total dick about things. I'm gonna go jump into this town, though, and hopefully end our turn here. Uh, five moves here, which is good. Our their temperature is kind of cold, so we are gonna, you know, be in a tough spot really soon here. Scavenge is about... This, I believe, was locked, if I remember correctly, right? Or is this something new? Oh, no, this is new. Excellent. All right. Oh, ho, ho, ho. All righty, so this is a new item as well. And baked bean cans. Uh, oh, yeah, right shoe, uh, right size sh uh, shoe, I should say. So let's uh, put this on. There you go. 
How's this guy doing? 65? Nah, mine's better. Alrighty, um, we'll think we could take this one over that one. Alright, that's good. Crew torch, wouldn't be a bad idea, especially at nighttime right now. I do have the lighter to light it up, too. Interesting predicament. Now, let's go and put the hatchet on. Oh, I'm such a fool, I forgot I built the vehicle, too. Sorry, guys, I built the vehicle. So I, I can actually carry some extra stuff now. Maybe the broad-handed spear would not be a bad idea for me to build after all. I am relatively tired, though, so I gotta be careful about that. Um, alrighty, well, this kind of changes everything now, doesn't it? So, let's think about this cautiously here. This could pretty much now go in the... in here, right? And we could just basically use the hatchet in the other hand. So we have a ranged attack, and we also have the, um... the hatchet for us here. Now, I'm gonna say that my guy is lefty, just because I, I can, I guess. <laughs> With that said, nope. No, you motherfucker, you put that shit in the right hand. He's left it. He's basically a gunslinger, so he's just gonna basically, he's a southpaw, as people call it. He's gonna be uh, slinging stuff from his left hand. Alright, that's good. Now... You know, I'm really tempted. Here's what I'm tempted to doing. I'm tempted to doing this. Just so I could kind of travel a bit right now, because we do need to find somewhere to camp. I'm tempted to doing this, which is this right here, and we will, um, we should be able to light this motherfucker somehow. Um, crafting, going to crafting. We have four moves left, so let's uh, put this guy here, along with uh, lighter. Alrighty. No, don't start a campfire. And we'll just do the crew torch, right? Yeah. So we'll confirm this, clear it out, go back over here, put this at a hand. Put this in your fucking hand. I said. Don't you condescend me, Avatar. Alrighty. So we're good. And you know what? Just because we can, might as well take this with us too. How's this for value? Let's take this just in case we could sell that in the refugee camp. You never know. I could use some money anyway. Alrighty, so that's good for now. I'll, I'll live with that. Now, this doesn't exclude us from sleeping though, which I would love to do. Shelter, absolutely none. No alertness. Yeah, this seems so sketchy to sleep here is a problem. We are holding the torch though. So. Oh, hey. Humanoid corpse? Who are you? <gasps> there is a god. Okay, um, put this on. <laughs> Wait a minute, you didn't put it on? Put that shit on, bro, what is your problem? It's a long code. Right, let's take this off momentarily and empty it out while we're at it. Put it on. Yeah! Yeah! That'll keep us kind of warm, I would imagine. Yeah, see, outdoor temperature jumps. Yeah, this is gonna fucking definitely do it. Look at that condition, too, 99.9, 99.8. That's really amazing, alrighty. Oh, hey, look at this. Uh, empty this out. What is this? Bear root? Okay, I'm not sure what that's for, but I'm gonna take it regardless. And these pants are 99.8. What are, what are our pants at? Yeah, better pants too, so empty this out. Pants go away. Pants come on. Alright. Put this right about there. And, uh... Hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Now, we're gonna definitely lose the capability of the... Yeah, so you have to pick one or the other. I can't use everything. I can't be too greedy about this. So, 99.9. .9 and like, six squares, huh? Alrighty, Code, you've worn your use. I'm no longer a hipster. So, uh, we definitely want to keep this at hand, though. So let's not... Make sure that doesn't go too far away here. Let's put you in the soft birch bag, I guess. Put that right there, and get the glass shift going right there. And we'll take the bear root as well. I'm not sure what it's for, but hey, you know what? That's the thing about stuff. We take stuff and explore it and whatnot. Alrighty, so... Relatively a uh, really fortunate find for us. Now, do I want to sleep in an area where this man died? I would imagine no. So let's try to jump, uh, jump up, jump up, and get down. I guess we're gonna go over this side. There's a forest here, and I'm a little bit fucked. But at the same time, yeah, no shelter. Oh hey, <laughs> oh it's the I've been here before. Hell yeah, bro. All right, you put that on. Yeah. All right. And we'll take this now that we can. Oh, and pebbles, too. Yeah, we'll take some fucking pebbles. We need them for the sling. Excellent. All righty. I'm uh, running into a bit of bit good luck here, suddenly. All righty. Um, now, we're still tired, though, and wary. We need to get some, and we're thirsty as well. Let me see if I could get to that little town over here. Send our turn here. Nothing attack me at night. We're good. Continue going over here. Scavenges area. I don't think I've been here before, so let's, man, check this out. Um, eh. Yeah, let's use this one. Holy, alrighty, we got a good... Oh, nice, we can make our own arrows now. So, 
I, I don't need to destroy this, right? Like, I just have to... Or, wait, 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 craft, right? You have to go to craft, if I remember correctly. It's been a while since I made arrows, so forgive me for this. Paper scraps, there we go. Clear. Excellent. Alrighty. Still have a few moves left. So, um, sterilized water? Yeah, I know how to make sterilized water, my friend. Do you who do you take me for? What are you taking me for? So we'll take this and this for now. Just so we can make our arrows later on. Don't need this. Don't need that. Alrighty. Shirts. Okay. Um, let's take some shards. You never know when you could use these bad boys. And there's another lighter, huh? Sweet. Alrighty. Take that too. And you know what? Tarp. We could actually... Oh, and stones, huh? Lock. Oh, stone. You could only do two at a time? Or is that because they're a different condition? Might be only two at a time. So let's just take those with us, though, just in case. And take the tarp so we can make ourselves a little bit of a makeshift shelter on the way. We just gotta find some wood and we'll be good to go. Um, can I sleep here, relatively? It doesn't seem that we should and could, but you know what? I'm getting really, really tired at this point, so I kind of have to risk it. As much as I don't want to. It's really risky, man. I, I'm i gonna do it. Or try, at least, to sleep. I woke up. Crew torch fell apart. I should have probably turned that off before I went to sleep, though. You know, just in case uh, people don't, you know, be like, what's going on over there? There's a fucking torch in the middle of the night. Um, yeah, let's try to go back to sleep if we can. This is risky, I know, but I feel like I have to at this point, right? All right, nothing happened to us, thankfully. We're well rested. I mean, we could have definitely used better, but, you know, again, we have insomnia, so we have to. It takes us a bit longer to get some rest. We need the pills, obviously. Alrighty, so four moves. We're thirsty, and holy shit. Hey, man. Um, who are you? Offer to talk. Or actually, let's just offer a ceasefire. Um, stranger advances towards player. Uh, okay. So, um, he's definitely wants to fight. He's a bad mother, of course. A fucking course. So, that's okay, bad mother. You know why it's okay? Because suddenly, birds appear, and I am gonna just wreck your shit right now if I'm allowed to. So let's go in here, and, um... Put my sling back over at hand. I'm gonna just sling this motherfucker with pebbles is what I'm gonna do. Show you to fuck with me. Alrighty, put this right here. Yeah, you wanna take a pebble to the head? Alrighty, well, we can play this game. Believe me, we can play this game indeed. So let's confirm, um... I'm not sure how... What's the range on this guy? I guess we're gonna find out. I think it's 20 if I read correctly. But we'll see. Alrighty, so he's gonna keep coming at us. That's alright, advance. I'm gonna take that fucking spear off of you, by the way. Believe me, I could use a definitely good, um... Oh, I could shoot from now. Okay, wait, wait. Stop right there. Alrighty, so, ranged attack. Let's do it. Uh, and hits. Player whip bad mother's left arm with a slung pebble. Didn't really do much to him now, did it? <laughs> Let's try it again. Ah, uh, player attacks, but misses. Alright. Try it again. But misses. God, he's getting closer now, isn't he? Should switch over to my fucking bow real soon. <laughs> I'm a little bit terrified right now. And misses. Okay. Yeah, I'm not liking this at all. Pebbles, you could go fuck yourself. Pebbles, Flintstone, let me take the stone over here and try this with the stones, maybe. Are right, you piece of shit? So, um, well, you know, we could fall back. I mean, must be at least one space away. Alrighty, let's, uh, I don't want to retreat. I really do kind of want to fight him, but let's fall back. Let's not let him get too close to us. Why can't I? Oh, because I'm on pebbles. Stone, there we go. Fall back. There we go. So let's, uh, sling this shit now. Oh, wait a minute. Something happened. Uh, Bad Mother demolished, player demolished, um, Bad Mother's lower right leg with a slung stone. Bad Mother cannot run in combat, has fallen to the ground and must regain for to continue. Right leg's been crippled, is stunned and unable to move for a moment. Ha ha ha! All right, you piece of shit. You want to be dodging my pebbles? You can't dodge a stone now, can you? All righty, so here's what I'm thinking. Let's move back a bit. Let's see what he does. He's still coming at us, though, right? Bad Mother's son unable to move for a moment. All right, he's unable to run, but, you know, he's he's fallen, too. Which makes me wonder, should I just sling him one more time? I guess I will. Then I miss. God fucking damn it. He got up again, too. And I'm out of stones. All right. Actually, that's not completely true. I have one more stone, I guess I'll equip that and, like, see if we can make it work here. At least he can't run anymore, so he can't cover too much ground, and that's, uh, the important part here. So let's fall back. Now let's just, uh, sling this shit here. Alrighty, and we... Ooh, we got him in the chest, now he's coughing up blood, unable to move, have uh, trouble concentrating, bleeding, everything's pretty much going the wrong way for this man. Alrighty, so now let's put these pebbles back in here. 
I know I'm using these up, but, you know, I feel it's kind of important at this point. I feel like getting close to him now, but... I don't know, I'm still a little bit terrified about doing that. Let's find out, though, advance. Uh, Bad Mother's bleeding. Is he getting up? He's crippled. He's behind cover now. <laughs> so let's advance. Coughing up blood, he's no longer behind cover. Falls back. Front player behind cover. Oh yeah, he's just terrified at this point. Alright, you piece of shit. Oh, you're gonna oh, suddenly you're not a tough guy anymore now, are you? Okay. I see how it is. Bad Mother takes cover from player. He's just behind cover at this point, huh? I feel like rushing him. Alright, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna rush him indeed. I'm gonna ditch vehicle for now. And let's see here. What do I have as a... Okay, I have the hatchet, huh? Okay. That could definitely work. So now let's start rushing him. Because he doesn't stay in cover right now, so... Oh, I'm tired too. Fucking goddamn it. Charge him again. Bad Mother's taking cover. Alrighty. Getting closer. Ranged attack, huh? Um, is he still behind cover? Uh... No, he just, fall, he just fell back. Alright, perfect. Sling him now. And... Hits. And I upper, I battered his upper right arm with a slung pebble. And is he behind cover again? No. He's just falling back now. Let's, let's sling him one more time. Unconscious. Alrighty. Nice. We got him. Knocked him out and everything. So, that was good. Relatively, that was my first uh, combat with the sling. And I think that went really more, you know, really well, all things considering. So now, let's just equip this again. And we can just go into combat and actually just get to him. And I'll just probably, more than likely at this point, just... Destroy him with the hatchet up close, huh? Now I'm tired again, which is the big the big problem here. Um, of course I didn't get a good night's rest, so we do remember that. But at the same time, I do I did hear that this mod has made it a bit difficult to um has made the game significantly more difficult. So you get tired more often and things to that degree. Um, alrighty, let's just loot this guy. All right, let's see what he had. Got some jeans on, some pebbles. I will definitely take those, my friend, because we've been using them quite well. And a glass shard, I think we have... Did that go into my vehicle? It better have. It did. And let's see, we'll definitely take this. This is about to break, unfortunately, though, so... That's okay. What I'll do is equip this, and then this will go into my vehicle. Right foot. Mmm... Yeah, relatively okay. You know what, this is actually good for money, though, so we'll take that. I could, you know, I could care less about that. Alrighty, all good. I'll take it. So, successful battle. That was good. And uh, we have our vehicle, right? Yeah. So now let's just, um, I guess we'll do a hidden retreat. <laughs> no reason why. Okay. So, really good battle. I, I enjoyed that one. That was pretty good. Let's find out what we have to do here in regards to, um, continuing forward. Alright, that's all the stuff I left behind. So we are tired again, so we have to look forward to that, and we're actually kind of parched too. So luckily there is a water stream coming up, so we're gonna... Okay, who the fuck is this now? Jesus Christ, this goddamn mod is riddled with combat. Alright, can you, like, leave me alone? Like, that'd be fucking swell if you did. Alright, I just wanna get some water, my friend, alright? That's all I want, so... Water, thankfully, and hey, so we got some more Pebbles Flintstones here, so let's take those. I mean, can you put them here with the rest of them? That'd be great. Alrighty, thank you. Um, now, put this over here and get some water going on here, because god damn it, do we need it. So obviously this water isn't, uh, properly tested. But I could, um, heat it up, although I don't have any way to... Hmm. Let's see, sterilized water boiled, yeah. I have a, I have a water fireproof container and a heat source. Well, I need to make a small fire first is a problem, huh? So, uh, do I have anything to make a fire right now? Let's find out. See, I got lighter, which is step one. And then step two, maybe some rags? Yeah, I could use some rags. Clear that out. All right, good. Let's, uh, not make another one. That's one's enough. So now we have a fire. So we'll put this right here. We'll put some water with it. And where is my, um, saucepan at? Saucepan? Saucy pan? There you are. Alrighty, sterilized water. Fuck yeah. So we'll just go ahead and, uh, times three. Yeah, we want to make it times three. Why times two? And, um, make another one? Yeah. Do it. Excellent. Alrighty. So, let's, uh, drink some of this up. Sterilizes all up here. Mixed all in with the bad one, obviously. 
Alrighty, so we'll drink some more of this, some more of this, and we might as well just fill her up, you know? And then we'll basically fill up the bottle that we have here, which is filled with a char. That's going to be really dangerous. How about we empty that out, man? <laughs> What's wrong with you, putting chars in bottles? Alrighty, and we can make some more water, and we definitely will, so let's get back in here. And sterilize water times three. Not enough moves left. That's a goddamn shame, but at least we got some thirst out of the way. Let's end our turn. Don't come at me. Uh, that dude looks pretty badass, though. Like, he has, like, a like some sort of, like, green vest on. And I'm really tempted to go after this deer for some food, by the way. But, uh, you know, one step at a time here. Our, our, our fire did go out. That's a, a goddamn shame. But you know what? We can make water. Or we could boil or sterilize water whenever we want, you know? So how, how about this? We... Just take some water with this guy. And I think that's... Yeah, alrighty. So you can take up to two. That's, that makes sense. It's been a while, I remember, guys. So I'm um, still remembering the steps here. So that's it for now. You can't put water in there. That wouldn't make sense, right? Of course not. Alrighty. So how about we go after this uh, deer over here? I think that's a good idea. We could definitely use some food anyway. So let's go start off with... Some pebbles, and maybe we could get this motherfucker pretty good. So he's gonna try to run away, obviously, so let's just range attack him, see what happens. So uh, he just ran away. Um, oh, he, he's coughing up blood after that one pebble shot. Good. Good, good. Now, um... Let's advance a bit. He's gonna run away. That makes sense. 30, yeah, we're not, we're not getting anywhere near him, unfortunately. He's gonna probably advance. I'm gonna, I mean, I'm thinking of ditching the vehicle, but I need to be relatively close to him to make it happen. I'm not going to shoot in the dark game. So that's a way to, you know, get a person pregnant, on, unfortunately, when you're not really planning it. Shooting in the dark? Yeah, you know. Alrighty, let's just uh, end our turn because we have no other option at this point. Alrighty, deer, I still see you. You're not fooling anybody, deer. Those fucking antlers of you. Alright, four away. Good. So range attack him. Uh, and hits. Uh, player better deer's upper right arm with a sling pebble and trying to retreat but can't get away. Easy attack for a moment. Okay, let's do it one more time. Whipped a pebble, and he hit, but nothing too indicative to anything else, so we'll just do it again. I hit him in the head. <laughs> we'll try it again. And severe pain is having trouble concentrating. Okay, so now what we do is we switch over to broad spear stab and try to move close. Oh, he's going to run away now, is he? So let's ditch vehicle for now. Oh, this is going to start playing this game again, are we? I remember this game from the last run, dear. Piece of shit, where are you leading me to? Ditch vehicle. He's in severe pain. God motherfucking damn it. You're in severe pain. You don't act like it with all the running away you're doing. Don't. No. I am not going to be happy until this fucking deer dies. I'm telling you right now. Is this the same deer? His condition doesn't seem, um... His condition seems really good. I don't think this is the same deer. We lost our deer. That's a load of shit, man. And turn. Are you the same deer? Are you the same doe? I think that deer booked it. And he made me use up my pebbles for absolutely nothing. It pisses me off. Alright. Well, we tried. I would have really loved to have gotten that guy for food. But, you know, what can you do? So let's loot this area here. There's another one of these guys here. 87.3. How is ours doing? Eh, you know. Ours is not that good. But I don't really feel like unloading everything right now. <laughs> I'm a little bit lazy. Alright, so leave me alone. Let's, um... Put this right here first and foremost, combine these two bad boys, alright. And what the fuck is this? Bunch of metal wires and scraps. I'm not sure what that's for, but we did find more pebbles and that makes me relatively a happy camper. So we'll put that right there, even though, you know, they're not necessarily too, um, reliable. But it's something, I suppose. And we'll take this as well. 20, okay. How are we doing with the rags, by the way? Do we still have rags? We do. We have eight. Let's uh, take this guy and take this guy and we'll take this as well. We'll take that as well. And we'll take another bottle with us as well if we can. Okay. And handful of maggots. I'm still not sure what this is for, but I really don't want to grab maggots anymore. Alrighty, so now we're still tired. Well, we've been tired. <sighs> I don't think that's the same deer. He's taunting me, but I don't think it's the same deer. Are you saying? Oh, you're, oh, I thought he was gonna say in range. Scavenge this shed over here and see what's about. Nothing. Question is, can you get past the lock? I can't. I can't, game. You know I can't. Stop trying to mock me about it. Alrighty, let's see. 
Deer is somewhere over there. I don't think it's worth me trying to fucking pin that guy down, though. He's a fast individual, man. Don't let him fool you. He's a fast, sturdy guy. We got some combat boots, though. I'm, I'm digging that. Not digging the condition too much, however. Hey! Football jacket! That's probably what that guy was wearing. But you know what? I, I don't want to give up my sweet-ass coda for this, so how about... Damn, this is filling up really quickly now, isn't it? We definitely have to keep we have definitely have to keep an eye on this. But you know what's also important? Uh, the, fan of, the fact that we found more stones, and that is ammunition for our pebbles. So, or not our pebbles, but our actual sling. So we definitely want to grab a few of these bad boys. Eh, might as well take that right there. Well, let's see, a pair of binoculars, huh? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Now, if do I need to have like the whole binocular set, or can I use this shit like a monocle type of thing and just use like one? piece of the binocular. So like say if I did this along with some string, would it would it, you know, attach? I've never tried that before. I think it's a good thing for experimentation though, wouldn't you say? So let's see here. Uh, where is my medium string? God damn it. It's medium string? Hey, am I just missing it? Is it right in front of me? I'm missing it, guys. Did I leave it behind? No, it's right there. Um scope with strap. Okay, so we'll confirm that. Clear it out. And if I'm right, this should just attach straight up to... Hey. Hey. Yeah, <laughs> there we go. So, now we have a... Uh, wait. Go over there. Now you can attach that to that. So, one of the big issues, one of the things that I've actually... You know, thanks to you guys, um, that you can attach more stuff to the pendant, which I've always, you know, completely avoided altogether because, you know, I don't want that ray to come all screaming, yelling at us and stuff, you know? But now that's no longer a case. And you know what? We might as well take as many fucking pebbles as we can. Why not, you know? You know, not often you run into this big pile of pebbles anyway. I don't need you, boot. I said pebbles, not boots, all right? There we go. And now I'm carrying a moderate load? <laughs> that's what she said. Ah, no, she really never said that. Um, and, um, I guess this could kind of go fuck itself at this point, huh? So, I'm, I'm unburdened now. All right, so, but I'm kind of really pushing it at this point in terms of how much we could carry. So, we got that going on. How are we close to the... We're kind of getting there. Again, I, I would get there faster, but I'm trying to explore and get some, you know, good items in the way there. So how about we call it an episode here today, guys? Um, Everything went pretty good so far, and um, at least we killed that one motherfucker, which was really satisfying for me. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I will catch you guys next time.